Once upon a time, in a little cottage, lived Jack and his mother. They were as poor as church mice and owned only a cow named Daisy. One day, Daisy decided to go on a milk strike. No moo, milk today, she seemed to say. So Jack's mother told him, Jack, take Daisy to the market and sell her for a good price. On his way, Jack met a funny old man who offered him magic beans for the cow. Beans? Jack laughed. Are they jumping beans, dancing beans, or just lazy beans? But the old man promised they were no ordinary beans. They were magic. So Jack, tickled by the idea, traded Daisy for the bean. When he got home, his mother was less than pleased. Magic beans? She cried, tossing them out the window. Go to your room. Maybe you'll find some common beans there. But as Jack slept, the beans grew into a huge beanstalk soaring into the sky. In the morning, Jack couldn't believe his eyes. He scampered up the beanstalk and found himself at a giant's castle. Inside, he discovered a room filled with treasures, golden coins, a hen clucking out golden eggs, and a magical harp with a sense of humor. Strum me, I'm no harp to play with. It joked. As Jack sneaked around, he heard the giant's voice boom. Fee, fi, fa, fo, fum. I smell the fun of a little one. Jack giggled to himself. He decided to borrow the hen and the harp for a little while. But as he tiptoed away, the harp shouted, He's taking me on a musical adventure. The giant woke up and chased after Jack, thundering like a one-man band. Jack slid down the beanstalk with the hen and the harp, laughing all the way. Mother! Chop down the beanstalk! With a great thud, down came the giant, landing in a big, soft haystack. Jack, his mother, the hen, and even the harp laughed and laughed. From that day on, they lived merrily, enjoying golden eggs and music, thanks to Jack's beanstalk adventure. And the giant? Well, he opened up his own haystack jumping business, and they all sometimes heard him laughing in the distance. And as for Daisy, she came back home claiming she had simply been on a cowcation. And so they all lived happily and hilariously ever after. The end, the end.